Fans of Archer may find themselves doing some spy work of their own because there is an online scavenger hunt going on now, and it is legit. There is some cryptography in this. Yeah. So, there is an, um, a thread right now on Imager slash Reddit from user Shitty Titty, which I, I am so happy for news voice people to read out loud Damn. in all seriousness. Thank you. Shitty Titty. <laughs> Shitty Titty. So um, this is one of my favorite cartoon series, and I think one of yours. Yes, so absolutely. this is a lot of fun for people who... Uh, so basically what started is on the show and this season, this current season, season six, uh, ISIS is over. They are now in the CIA. Mm -hmm. um, so there, there have been hints, including um, Conway Stern's profile had a hex hexadecimal code, which you can translate. I don't want to explain it all. You can definitely go to the Reddit site. Right, but it is very circuitous. It involves uh, um, first that hexadecimal code, then an audio file in which you need to play it in a certain way. Then you have to look up code. the You have to look up the definition of the word circuitous. Yes. <laughs> oh, good word. Good use. That's exactly right. You have to use various ciphers. There are fake Craigslist ads posted by Krieger. Dr. Krieger is the one running this. Ooh. Uh, there <laughs> are... <laughs> oh, don't, 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 don't. Your authority is not recognized yeah. for kick-ass. <laughs> so there, and then there's a... Krieger is posting on Reddit, specifically in the LSD subreddit, because that is what he is about. Yeah. And so you're looking around, using the chemical code for LSD. Uh, it's still going on. As more episodes come out, you can keep following the cipher. The, it goes to Algersoft, which mm -hmm. is uh, Krieger's website. Right. And of course, uh, the username is Krieger, and the password is guest. Yeah, well, guest, that's, that's, <laughs> that's in the thing. It's like, you got to be kidding me. we got to do better. Um, nope. Yeah, but uh, it's amazing. This is one of those shows that, I mean, to figure out any step along the way in this, mm -hmm. the fact that anyone has done that is amazing. It's definitely a testament to how much this people love this so show. This would be so easy to just skip over. Like you can be like, oh, that's just writing in their their intranet, you know, like their sixties, whatever. Who cares? It reminds me of like, did you ever watch uh, Strong Bad Emails? Uh, Homestar. So there used to be this thing called Homestar Runner. It's still around. I know around, about Homestar actually. Runner. So Strong Bad did emails when I was in college in two thousand. Boom, 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 boom. Um, <laughs> so there was, but after it was over, there were little parts of the screen that were still active, and you would click it. But that was very easy once you figured out there were like you know hot points on the screen. You would just click all over the screen. This involves noticing at the bottom what seemed like... This involves a ciphers. Yeah. This involves running things through programs. This involves going through a bunch of different sites. You actually have to use skills to do this mm -hmm. instead of just clicking around randomly, which I am totally unprepared for. Yeah, skills way more sophisticated than any demonstrated by anyone besides maybe Krieger on Archer. I mean, I could see people easily forgetting this and then later like, oh... The creators of Archer hid this and we never knew the whole time. Yeah, this is a thing I think m more shows need to do. I mean, a lot of a lot of shows are trying to crack the problem of like the online engagement component of having their show. Like uh, At Midnight does really well with the hashtag, hashtag wars. Whatevers. But like this kind of thing is something that that is so specifically Archer. Yes. And so you know, Archer has there's blogs you can go and research every literary reference that they make on the every, show. Every esoteric reference Archer makes. For some, for some reason, he's really well-read. Yeah. I don't know. That's the, that's the beauty of it. It's yeah. just he isn't trying. He's hapless in many ways, but then in so many ways, that everything, he's just so good, so talented. He's never so really... Dr. Krieger is running this. Yeah. So we've already seen the LSD part of his life. Uh, maybe some Hante anime wife in the future mm -hmm. type website. So some get ready for action. that shit. Clone action, uh, wondering maybe maybe his other clones, co clones. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It could go in so many different ways, and I think that's a really fun part of this. Yeah. So uh, Archer Vice, I want to get your feelings on Archer Vice. I didn't like it. You didn't like Archer Vice. Have you rewatched Archer Vice on Netflix? I did. You did, and you still don't like I it. I still don't like it. See, I rewatching Archer Vice liked it a lot more. Pam than is the first so time. annoying. Yeah, she does a lot of cocaine. I mean. I liked her the way she was. It was, they, they, I think Archer literally says that. Yeah. 
I like that they go. They had. They took some time. They had some confidence, and they just went and did Archer Vice. They took an entire year to do something different, and they came back with like a refreshed sure. perspective. Sure, I, I will give you that. Yeah, I mean, it was a ballsy move. Not many shows could pull it off. They certainly did, and now they're back, and everything's fresh. And there's this whole crazy Easter egg for uh, people who are much better at decoding things than I to follow. And of course, you can still follow that through the link as it keeps going on and on on Reddit. Uh, let us know what you think about all this, about this this code uh, this code breaking challenge, and also the new season of Archer uh, as it's airing below in the comments. And please be sure to subscribe for more.